Welcome back to the channel, y'all. This is a, a little bit of, I guess you could say, an emotional video because we are uh, finally getting to packing up my room and uh, getting a lot of stuff ready for the big move. But uh, I wanted to show you what I got packed so far of my hobby stuff and how crazy it's been. So as far as my workstation, it looks normal. But then you start creeping into my rest of the bedroom and geez, a lot of clothes. Then my closet is almost fully empty. Yeah, it's trippy. So besides that and the closet being empty, this used to be filled with Tamiya stuff up here. And it's now done. Get in there. And here we go into where I have slowly gathered all my stuff. And uh, yeah, this is not everything, obviously, but I still have um, my desk up and a lot of stuff there along the floor so this is stuff basically my mini for all drive stuff that i'm not going to be needing to do projects or work on my own my cars that i use at the moment um but we do have here uh two bins of kits uh one bin is of kits that are pre-built cars and the other one is of kits that are enclosed and, well, not built. And we got here old boxes with some old chargers. Another old case that I used to use for my mini Z's. Another case I used to use for um, my mini four wheel drive stuff back when I was a lot younger. Um, Got some extra stuff in there. Got a RC stand. So I got a lot of crap, a lot, a lot of stuff. But we're getting it together. So we're back. Other than me moving, we got a new project underway. I decided to go away from using this FMA chassis that was for a previous build. If these wheels look familiar, well then you already know what build I'm talking about. So I'm gonna go away from using this FMA because I don't want to build new stays and do a full build. So I want to do a FMAR. And we are gonna be using all these awesome looking parts. So this is what I got to start with. And the chassis is already cut as you guys seen in the previous pictures. So I cut the sides off there, there. I still need to cut this guy off here, but it's all nice and smooth, nice and cut. I even shaved these down a little bit so it could be like um, a little bit smoother going up the ramp. Or actually, it'll be flipped so it doesn't really matter. <laughs> but for sure, we are underway. Also, the whole reason I'm going away from another FMA chassis is because I have a uh, fully built FMA to begin with that I am very happy with and don't feel like I need two FMA cars, but I guess I need multiple MS cars, so I'm weird like that. Anyways, back to work.
Yes, and we're back to the garage. That means I didn't film the rest of the belt, but we're almost done, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a yes. And we got a couple more carbon pieces to add to this build, so I shall show you in a minute. But I miss my studio. I don't know why. It's like I haven't been here in forever, but anyways. You know how it be sometimes. You just miss your hang hangout spot. BRB with uh, some more info on the FMAR build. All right, so I ended up getting in the mail the other day the matching 20, I think it's, yeah, 2017 J-Cup carbon fibers to go with this recent build of mine that has all this 2017 Jacob car fighters. So we're gonna be using this to make something hopefully. But um, overall, I wanted to uh, tell you guys how I made these wheels prior. And well, I just used a Tamiya saw and uh, my good old, uh, well, hands. So when you look at the wheel in the front, um, you're gonna see on some of the wheels they have like a plastic line almost all the way around the wheel and that's where you want to cut and then you just sand down till your inspects um, they're nice and straight but anyways besides that let's get to finishing up the front of this so it's not yeah all right got the front piece here cut and finalized so it keeps my angle, my thrust angle, um, pretty stuck because of it being the 2017 J-Cup Carbon, it matches to rest and uh, kind of weird like that. And since the rear didn't match for the brake, I decided to use the last one and I'm going to uh, replicate the FRP so I can have the break as what that basically looks like. So yes sorry Bob. And we're on our way. Alright, old piece, new piece. All I gotta do left is countersink the bottom here and bolt it up. <laughs> Alright, and we back. Got the front done like I showed you in the previous clip. And now I got the rear brake finished. It looks so cool because of all the matching carbons. Very pleased with it. And the weight lines up perfectly. Only thing left to do now is a test. So let's get her done and see how she do. What, you recording? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Yeah. I am glad. <laughs> <laughs> <Anyways>. <laughs> <laughs> We're here with the new build, the FMAR. So, we are gonna give it a go. You wanna call it? Ready, set, go. Oh, that's um, ding, ding, ding. <laughs> Wait, well, what happened here? I don't think I put the switch on. No, I didn't. Oh. Uh, <laughs> Re-race. Ready, set, go. Really? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. Yeah, the switch is all right. Let's make sure this is quick. All right. It's quick, so if it pops off, it's because it's not a good 
the tires. Let's get it. Ready, set, go! So we're gonna be getting this uh, rear weight off of here because it's jumping like a rocketeer. And um, I wanted to jump flat instead of like this. So it's way too much weight in the rear. Um, but BRB and we're gonna get this thing planted. All right, you guys ready for the heat? Because we got it running right. And we uh, put some less weight on the rear I uh, got some more brake on the front it's only slight brake though because it's the blue brake and um well it's running pretty darn fast you ready babe? oh yeah okay. ready set go Well, thank you guys for watching. You know, we love building new cars for you. And, uh, well, I always enjoy, you know, seeing what else people refer me to building. So if you guys have any comments, you know, stuff you think I should try out, let me know. I don't uh, like staying with the same chassis all the time. So um, happy I got to doing this FMAR and, well, it's running good now. So. Thank you again for your ref uh, referral, um, and uh, please subscribe, comment, share, and there you go.